Round from uh, sailingbritain.com and we have now just finished our major refit. As you can see we've done some uh, work on the chain and anchor, I've painted the anchor so we'll be able to see it much easier and put different colours for different metres as, as the chain goes out. As we go along here you'll see the hull. We have totally, we've totally scraped it back from its old layers. There's eight layers of uh, anti-foul on it so we scraped it all back put two coats of primer on, two coats of antifoul, serviced the bow thruster and I've given the side a nice bit of a polish and got rid of all the algae off the side and all the uh, white off the blue. Also if you look up, go up there now, on the mast, the mast has been taken out and we've had new shrouds put in and so all those all those are now brand new and should last 15 years without being wanted to change. Also, I've changed all the lights from halogen to LED. Right, let me go to the uh, after the boat and show you what we've done over there. Okay. Here we've got changed all the anodes all around the boat, on the propeller shaft, on the end of the propeller. Also, we have cleaned that off. It was encrusted very much with barnacles and everything so we're taking it all off and we're using a secret weapon that someone has told me has worked very well. I've noticed about 100 boats coming out and the prop was the cleanest. I went over and spoke to him and he said it was five coats of egg white which is very cheap to do. So if you look over here you will see the rudder. What we've done is we've taken the rudder down and changed the top and bottom bearings of the rudder so that is now working perfectly and also inside we changed the wires of the steering. We're now on the deck of Britigan at the aft. As you can see down here we have a hydraulic system. We have three hydraulics on here. We have the backstay, the boom vang and the outhaul of the main sump. They have all been reconditioned and all the seals renewed and all the oil changed. Over here, if you can have a look, I haven't fitted it back up yet, but we've had the life raft serviced, so ready for us doing the arc. And the backstay is all completely new, with all with the shrouds.
Now we're in the centre part of Brissigan on the deck. If you look down there you will see our windows that are a bit silver at the moment because that is aluminium or for our American colours aluminium and they were bubbling up because uh, of the conditions they were so they've been stripped back and when we're on the water we're going to respray them. The reason we're going to respray them on the water is because it's very dusty here on the yard and we don't want we wanted to try and get it as best as possible and if you look around We've all got new old running rigging, which is the ropes, halyards, sheets, obviously. Oh, we're now at the bow of Briskin, and over here we have the furling mechanism, which then turns around and wraps the front sail, or the Genoa as it's called, around. It's a, a very expensive piece of equipment, and it's been serviced. And a new piece has been put in, because the, the last one was bent. Also, when you come down here, we have a brand new windlass because we broke the last one and we've now got this new one which we will not break. How do you feel, Sam? Oh, good. I'm happy, excited. This is coming back in the water. Yeah. yeah. We've got another excited one down here. <laughs> After six weeks of being parked here in the Ironing Marina, she's finally being put back in the water. Super excited. Uh, anytime the boat gets hoisted out or moved, for me at least, it creates like a sick feeling inside. I mean, that's our house right there that's just being moved. And uh, it's a bit nerve wracking. I feel really good when she's in the water. Time. It's been six weeks of the boat being out of the water and now it's back in the water. How does it feel? It feels great. It's bobbing up and down. It's a little bit of motion. It feels fantastic. I just can't wait to get the sails up and get sailing. We've got a couple more days of work left to do on it, but cheers. Yeah, for me! <laughs>